Did you know we actually have two different nervous systems? This is really cool science. Can't wait to share it with you. Hi, I'm Dr. Shimi Kang, and welcome to my channel, Mental Wealth, where you will receive prescriptions for health, happiness, success, and achievement. So today we're gonna to talk about our two nervous systems. Um, this is really important because when we understand this, we can understand how coping skills work, how peak performance works, how optimizing our brain and body all work. So our first nervous system is that survival nervous system. It's also called the sympathetic nervous system. Mm -hmm. This sympathetic nervous system gets activated uh, when we are stressed, when our body releases that freeze, fight or flight response. It um, takes all of our body's energy and it moves it into either freeze, which is anxiety, fight, irritability, or flight, which is running away or avoidance or distraction. Um, this is a very old, primitive, primitive, ancient nervous system that was meant for our survival and really meant to only be activated when our life was being threatened. So we really don't want to spend too much time in this survival or sympathetic nervous system, which is run on adrenaline and cortisol, both things that in the long term can really hurt us um, and cause lots of difficulties with our physical and mental health. Where we want to spend our time actually is in that parasympathetic or growth nervous system. Now, this is our nervous system of relaxation. Um, and we actually have a bit of a stigma to that word, don't we? Relaxation. But what we want to understand is this is where all the awesome stuff of life happens in the parasympathetic or growth or relaxation mm -hmm. nervous system. When we are in a state of relaxation and our parasympathetic or growth nervous system is activated, now we have the ability to mm -hmm. recover from illness, um, re recover from injury. We have the ability to learn and grow and create new synapses and new, new pathways in our brains and in our bodies. This is a nervous system where all love and creation and innovation occur. That's really where we want to spend our time. A really quick, easy way to know um, how to get yourself out of survival into that growth nervous system is I tell people anything you wouldn't do if you're being chased by a tiger will actually move you from survival to growth. So what I mean by this is ask yourself, if you were being chased by a tiger, would you stop and take long, deep breaths? No, you wouldn't. Um, and that is why breathing, especially deep controlled breathing like box breathing, um, can really help us move from survival into growth, help our mental and physical well being. If you were being chased by a tiger, would you stop and have a meaningful conversation with someone or share a laugh or a joke? No, you wouldn't. You would run like hell. That is why social connection going deeper in our relationships, sharing a laugh, uh, help us with our stress response and move us from survival to growth. If you're being chased by a tiger, would you stop and play? Would you do a cartwheel or look at an interesting leaf on the ground or stare at the clouds and see how interesting they look? Of course you wouldn't. You're being chased by a tiger, so play, curiosity, trying new things, um, anything recreational. Think of that word recreation is to recreate. Mm -hmm. When we are curious and we play and we try new and different things, a really powerful way to move out of survival and into that growth nervous system. So I just walked you through actually three categories of brain optimizers, three categories of peak performance training, and three categories of coping skills. These three categories are play, others, and downtime. Play, trying new and different things, being curious, others connecting socially with each other in a meaningful way, and downtime, unplugging from the world, things like mindfulness, gratitude, breathing, all of these things are fantastic coping skills, peak performance exercisers, because they move us from survival into growth. They move us from that sympathetic nervous system to that parasympathetic nervous system, that place that we want to be 
with that relaxation response where all growth, all learning, all recovery, all repair, and all innovation occur. So before I give my prescriptions for today, I want to remind you to subscribe to the channel and leave your comments below. Today's prescriptions are, again, that daily dose of play others and downtime. These three brain optimizers, coping skills, are really important daily activities that will help you stay out of survival, out of freeze, fight, or flight, and into that system of growth. 